I think that the beginner farmer program is an incredible tool for young farmers, new farmers. It, it provides a resource for them so that they can get good research-based, non-biased information. Kind of meets them where they're at by being available in formats that are going to appeal to the next generation of farmers. If it pulls everyone together, everything you need to know in one small area where you can talk to individuals and you can get the knowledge you need and build that network. You're not having to search Google and find contacts. You put a face with a contact, it's easy and it's right there and you can keep moving. Extension has been um, <laughs> priceless for me because I've learned so much going to the different courses. I took the Master Gardener course and then I've just gone to a variety of like workshops. Being able to talk to people with the knowledge of what Alabama growing and what Alabama agriculture is like is, is just fairly, very helpful. We came home with a library of stuff. <laughs> new information, great ideas, new contacts, and um, opportunities to network and learn. There's always something to, new to know. There are always tips and tricks to pick up. Um, there's so much science involved in what we do, and as that science is more information is uncovered and discovered and new ways of doing things and improvements, um, I think that hands-on workshops and, and events like that are a great way for farmers and, and especially beginning farmers to attain that information. I keep the IP, IPM slide charts, the vegetable growers handbook, and a lot of other extension publications handy at all times. The newsletters um, that keep us updated on pests and, and pest issues across the state are timely and incredibly beneficial. And then of course the handbooks become on a farm almost like our Bibles that we go to. We definitely use the IPM newsletter. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we also use the website. We just go back and look at references and um, there's always like a link to somebody else that you can find that might be doing things the way that you're doing it. So it's good to read about them. I have the Farming Basics phone app. You don't always have to have the answers, but sometimes you gotta know where to find the answers. And the Farming Basics phone app is a good use for that, whether it's pest identification, disease identification, tools like the Beginner Farmer uh, program, learn how to do things better so that they can, they can make more money, increase the profits, and maybe even reduce some of those labor needs. So the technical service providers come to your farm, know your things, and a lot of them know it just as well as you do. We didn't know how much there was, and we didn't know that it's available to us and covered. You know, you think a lot of times when you have somebody come out to your house, you have to pay for it. Uh, we've had technical service providers come in on our personal farm and help with our uh, food safety plans and they know our operation so when we're going through the inspections and filling it out they can fill out the paperwork and step us right through it it's the best thing you have